The Tigers hosted all corn on their home turf. Did this championship rematch leave the Tigers licking their wounds? Stay tuned, GFN starts now. Hello and welcome to GFN, I'm Damian Runnels. Last year, Gremlin beat Alcorn in a 1.0 OT nail biter for the Braves homecoming. Then they met again for the SWAG championship where Gremlin got straight handled by 28 points. With both teams projected to compete for the championship again, this game was the hottest ticket in the SWAG. We pick up the action deep in the first. After a long drive, Kincaid scrambles out of the pocket, directing traffic and then caught what a catch by chad williams at the five yards on chad williams pulls it in with a spectacular one-handed catch first down tigers a few plays later a penalty backs the tigers up kincaid looking for his man on the move again and finds martez carter with the nifty footwork bounces it outside for the first score of the game Later in the first, Tigers get the ball back. Kincaid goes for it all, caught by the receiver, then fumbled, giving the ball right back. Alcorn marches down the field, and then Noah Johnson, in trouble, throws back across the field. Touchdown, Alcorn. Ladarian Davis with a crucial one-handed grab to get himself on GFN. Second quarter, big man, Donovan McCray, put some respect on my name. Gets the sack in the end zone for the safety. For the second week in a row, he's put points on the board from the D-line position. Graham fam starting to feel the rally. After a long drive, Tigers go for it on fourth and one. Carter gets it, plus a whole lot more. First down, Tiger. After multiple tries, Kincaid, Tosses it over the middle. Touchdown, Jordan Jones gives the Tigers a little cushion before the half. Alcorn, trying to start a rally of their own, gets it to Jaborian McKenzie with the nice moves to get the Braves down the field. A few plays later, Footman took the last turn on the screen, but the Tigers defense turns it up to shut down any rally before the half. Third quarter. After throwing a touchdown to Verlin Hunter earlier in the quarter, Kincaid takes this one up the middle on the keeper. Keeps the ball, touchdown, Grambling State University. Tigers finally pulling away after keeping it close throughout the first half. Fourth quarter, the Tiger defense kept their foot on the gas. Footman sacked for a loss on second down. And then on third down, almost picked off. Now, what kind of grambling game would it be if Mr. Excitement didn't get in on the fun? Carter cuts it back, gets an opening, and slips at midfield. It's all good. A few plays later, Kincaid to Carter again. He turns it up, breaks the tackle. Carter on his feet, 25, 20, 50, 10, 5. Mr. Excitement does it again. Alcorn gets in striking distance, then Derek Dixon, the transfer from Texas Tech, gets the pick and puts the final nail in the coffin for the Braves. The Tigers run out the clock and improve their record to 3-1. At Robinson Stadium, the Tigers beat Alcorn 43-18. Next up, the Tigers head to Dallas to face another SWAC superpower, Prairie View. In last year's game, both teams combined for over 1,100 yards. Trey Green passed for over 2,600 yards in 2015. And this is the State Fair Classic, a premier matchup for over 90 years. Join us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And remember to tell a friend about GFN. I'm Damian Runnels. Thanks for watching. <laughs>